what is up leo welcome to your reading this is pretty intuitive back with another one i hope my leos are doing fine and dandy so this is a general reading keep an open mind um anything i'm saying here could be vice versa interchangeable okay so let's get into it leo let's see what is coming towards you in love i think i have this deck upside down Uh, please go ahead and smash that like button if you found this reading helpful. All right, Leo. What's coming to Leo in love? I am definitely picking up on a Piscean that you could be connecting with. What's coming to Leo in love? Leo. You have the Queen of Swords in the reverse. It's coming to Leo in love, Leo. What is up with this energy here, Leo? Um, hmm. Some of you may have went through some kind of separation or you're going through one or a breakup, okay? Um, could be connecting with a Virgo or an air sign here. But I feel like somebody is really uh, adamant on... Um, Maintaining their single dumb right now. Um, yeah, some of you went through a breakup. Lovers reverse. That's what I'm getting. I feel like someone at this point is just trying to move on with their life. Um, you could be realizing that this is a situation that's not ideal for you. This is a situation that you can't fix, that maybe you guys are just incompatible or, you know, there's a third determining factor as to why you and this person um, can't continue your relationship or your connection. And that reason is different for everybody. Um, but it does feel like with the Magician Reverse, someone tried. Maybe you both tried, but um, it's just not working out. Maybe you guys have different uh, views of relationships. Um, maybe you guys, you're, you know, what's important to you both or just it's not aligning right now. So let's say one of you wants to move to this place and the other doesn't. Those are, you know, important differences in relationships that could cause a breakup, obviously. Um, even religion and things like that. All right. Just coming to Leo and love. Tell me more, Leo. Tell me more. So if there's not a breakup now or a separation now, could be one on the horizon. Some of you, I am getting that, you know, maybe there was uh, a third party interference or something of that sort. You do have justice reversed. You may be connecting with a Libra, a Virgo, a Gemini, a Pisces. Um, from what I'm getting here, also Taurus, Okay. Justice reverse could mean someone didn't do the right thing. Uh, someone could have cheated. Whatever. Okay. I mean, anything. It's coming to Leo and love. But uh, it just feels as though uh, this is a situation that, you know, someone doesn't want to keep trying to, um, I guess, work on. Okay. It does feel like someone is looking to let this go at this point in time. Your energy, their energy, maybe you guys both energy, okay? Um, I'm getting that someone may have even pushed the other person away for some of you, if that's your situation, in order to be single here, okay? Um, maybe they feel like being single is more appealing right now, and they don't want to be in a relationship. Um, but the way they went about it probably was kind of fucked up. They probably went about it in a way of... Let me just push you away or make things difficult. That way you can break up with me type shit. But you do have the Hermit Reverse um, Virgo Energy once again. I, I'm hearing something about someone wanting to find themselves. They could have even told you some, some crap like, you know, I, I don't think a relationship is what I need right now because I want to find myself or I want to work on this or I want to focus on school or I want to do X, Y, and Z. For some of you, it probably was true. And for others of you, could have been BS. Okay, it's different for all of you. But it uh, feels like you and this person wasn't really making much progress here anyway. Um, so let's pull you an angel answer card. Let's see what uh, the cards are saying for you and this person. 
Leo in love. What messages do you have for Leo in love, please? You have codependency and you also have keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. So some of you needed to hear about that. But others of you, you probably don't want that freak, period. I'm not even going to just, I'm not going to lie. Um, codependency addictions are affecting your romantic life. I do feel some of you, maybe you were staying in relationships that wasn't really growing you. It wasn't progressing. It was stagnant. It was just crazy. Okay. Um, bottom of the deck, you do have new love. Now, some of you could be having another person, um, entering your life sooner rather than later or now. I'm also hearing for some of you, which it does sound fucked up. Someone may have broken up with someone because they want a new person. They want someone else. Um, the lover's reverse could be that type of the choice that was made here. Yeah, because after new love has separation. Okay, time apart from your partner is on the horizon. So, you know, it's, it's all kind of like making sense. Uh, but like I said, you're going to just have to pick and choose which is your situation because it's a general reading. It's not for all of you. Now, you do have distance. Maybe it was even long distance that broke you and this person Um apart here leo but uh you and your partner may be physically or emotionally distant yeah so yeah so for those new relationships unfortunately you know i do see you know some kind of breakup here to where you guys aren't are not aligning okay you have divorce experiencing a breakup this could even be a divorce guardian a lost loved one um watches over you some of you i'm hearing your mom or father or your father or your mother who passed away or someone who who you were close to a uh, grandmother a grandfather an uncle an auntie um i am i'm even hearing a sibling okay could be supporting you on this move on letting this go on moving forward with your life okay you have let go make room for the new beginning on its way to you now and you also have moving on Someone is unavailable, a waste of time. It's over, okay? Some of you, I am. <laughs> so, you, Leo, I'm hearing that this freak could have been a gold digger, okay? <laughs> and, and it's not funny, Leo, but it's just crazy how people just have no kind of, like, chill. But, um, yeah, this freak could have been a gold digger. Um, they want your money being used. Maybe you're realizing that maybe they're only with you for what you can do for them. And, but it does say that you're going to be meeting somebody new here. So um, I think you're going to be just fine. Um, Spirit is giving you the okay to just move on from this person and just let it go. Because it's, apparently it's not working. It's not it. You guys are just not aligning. And that's just what we see. So some of these cards here yeah all right leo you have nervous you make me nervous even just thinking about you i get nervous i'm not sure what to say or how to act around you some of you this person's nervous uh, i'm getting maybe they didn't even tell you the truth of uh why they even broke up with you or why they want a divorce they didn't tell you the real truth but this, you know, the tarot cards are going to tell you the truth here. I'm telling you the truth. That what, you know, because Queen of Swords reverse is someone who it's like she would become mean. She would like say certain things or do certain things to get you to break up with her. Um, you know, so that could be the dynamic that you experienced. Uh, if you're cross watching for a Leo and you were in a relationship with a Leo, perhaps this Leo didn't really give you the truth, the truth or, um, you know, justice on why they broke up with you. Maybe they just broke up with you or they just started to act funny with you and then boom, next thing you know, they don't, they're not saying anything, okay? But it does seem like this person was playing some kind of games here. This is a game to me. The way I'm acting, responding, or posting is to get your attention. So we see that this is some, someone who has like a lot of time to play a lot of games. Um, and if you're looking for something serious, then this is not it, obviously. Uh, I can never seem to figure you out. Sometimes I feel like you're hiding something from me. Never really know where I stand with you. So maybe you never know where you stand with this person. They they don't know where they stand with you. But I do feel like um, there's too much like vague situations going on in, in you know with this person. Um, so it's probably you know obviously better that uh, just separate, right? 
But if they never told you what was up, because Justice Reverse would say there was a lack of closure. There was a lack of, it's like someone feels like they were wronged or they weren't really, um, you know, being told the truth. Okay. So you could feel like this freak wasn't being honest with you or something. Okay. Then that's the truth. Okay. I think that, you know, it does feel like this freak pushed you away on purpose. That's just what I think. This Virgo, I am getting Virgo very strongly. Um, we also have Gemini. Uh huh. Virgo, Gemini, Libra, Pisces, energy. Um, they weren't keeping it real. So this is like you could take this as your, as your closure, Leo. Um, as you know, the truth that they never told you. Um, okay. All right, Leo, so um, that is what I have for you guys. I appreciate you guys being here with me. Um, once again, please hit that like button if you found this reading helpful. And I will talk to you guys soon. Thank you.